Hey traders from around the world. All right, in this super quick video, I'm gonna be showing you how to put in a stop limit with a different limit price. This is in case you want to buy something at a little bit of a lower price than where you're trying to get triggered in at. So for example, in this trade on Bumble, my thought is since it's a newer IPO, if it does in fact break out, it probably will retrace some. We can obviously see a perfect, perfect hammer candle right here on the daily chart and instead of just getting out exactly the breakout since it's a long lower shadow i'm gonna try to get in with a little bit of a lower limit entry and this one really really should be quite simple to do so i'm gonna pop over here into thinkorswim come over here and i'll show you how fast this is bnbl boom this is the entry go over to the daily chart bang right click right here by custom oco bracket and it's 100 shares actually 200 shares 200 shares, $10 of risk, $2,000 of risk. And if I go to stop limit, you'll see stop, I'm gonna make 79.99, okay? And then limit is 78.50. So I'm trying to buy it at a lower price. That's actually where I'm trying to get filled at. Stop loss, 69.50. And target, let's just make it one an even $100 for right now. Boom, just like that. And that is as simple as it gets good to cancel right stop 79.99 limit 78.50 stop 69.50 target 100 200 shares boom boom and bang there it is so this will not fill until bumble goes above 79.99 and then it has to go lower than 78.50 so 78.50 or lower in order to get filled so if it just runs to the moon we're not going to get filled, pulls back, boom, we're filled, and then hopefully off to the races we go. That's how you do the order. Really easy, super simple. Love the trade concept, love the strategy, and that's what I got. Hope it was helpful. You rock.